welcome back and today I'm gonna do something pretty different I'm gonna share with you guys a style video and this is gonna teach you guys how to style your statement necklaces I came up with three different looks for this video and I'm gonna show you guys how you can transform your look with just a simple statement necklace and how you can choose clothes that will kind of bring attention to your statement necklace and yet not have it overpower your entire look I'm gonna be styling one nighttime look a daytime look as well as a casual look for you guys. Now the first look I'm going to start off with is my nighttime look and I chose to style my statement necklace with a strapless dress and what this is going to do is really bring attention to the neck area because it's so bare and when you put a statement necklace there it not only completes the outfit it also gives a kind of extra something to the look I think. Now with necklines that are quite flat the way my dress looks right now I prefer to choose a statement necklace that doesn't dangle I think that something that dangles would look better with a v-neck or a heart-shaped neckline maybe but with a flat neckline I want something kind of round to counter that flatness I chose to pair this dress with a gorgeous gorgeous pair of earrings now a lot of people do say that you shouldn't over accessorize so don't put on a statement necklace and statement earrings at the same time and that does apply in some cases but with this dress because of its simplicity I think that you can add something extra and I chose to do that in the form of the earrings and what I did to kind of bring the look together by adding a green clutch and I feel like that green clutch paired together with the green necklaces really makes the whole look feel really put together Next is my formal outfit. Now if you're going for the blazer, a lot of looks can look a little bit too corporate, if you know what I mean. So what I chose to do is get a really funky, really out there kind of choker necklace. And I chose to pair this with really, really simple lines. And yet I did add a pair of shorts with a bit of pattern on them, just because I wanted to kind of bring a little bit of edge to the look while keeping it feminine with the florals on the shorts. Now this choker I think can be done well and it can be done in a really bad way as well. Remember that when you're doing this kind of statement necklace you want to pare it down. For example, this necklace is giving me a really rocker vibe right now and what I want to do to kind of counter that rocker vibe is put in that corporate blazer, you know, the clean lines and add in the femininity of a floral pair of shorts and I feel like everything kind of balances itself out to create a really nice kind of interesting look that really attracts the attention. So my third and final look is actually a casual outfit. I want to show you guys that you still can incorporate a statement necklace into a casual look. What I used was a very breezy open shirt and what I used with that was I actually placed the necklace underneath the shirt and I like the way you kind of see the necklace through the shirt as opposed to having it sit on top of the shirt. That way it's more casual, it's slightly more subtle. I paired this outfit with a pair of culottes. I absolutely love culottes. I think they're so comfortable and breezy. And I also included a really gorgeous box clutch. Now I am a huge fan of box clutches. And you can make these clutches seem a little less formal by adding the chain and stringing them over your shoulder. And that is it for my statement necklace styling video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed the video and found the styling tips and the products in the video helpful and interesting. Thank you so much to Red's Revenge for giving me the chance to use your accessories in the video. Guys, if you want to check out Red's Revenge, I have their Facebook page link below as well as a really special discount code that I'm able to share with you guys. It's all down in the description box below. Also, Red's Revenge is in stores in Malaysia so you guys can check them out in the actual store and they are really gorgeous stores by the way. I'll leave the addresses in the link box down below as well. Thank you so much you guys for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye!